A deadly shooting at a Dallas County government building. All of this happened this afternoon. Police responded to shots fired at the Dallas County Medical Examiner's Office. Ended up finding two people dead there. Our Aaron Jones is live at the Emmy's office in Northwest Dallas tonight. And Aaron, you've got a breaking news update for us. Fill us in. Well, Nicole, investigators are still here processing the crime scene. This is their command post right behind me. We did speak to county leaders earlier tonight who tell us that it appears that all of this stemmed from a domestic dispute. Around 4.30 p.m., calls of an active shooter on the second floor of the Dallas County Medical Examiner's Office started coming in. Authorities say they arrived to find two people dead. A Dallas County employee uh, involved in a domestic situation was killed and the uh, assailant uh, killed himself. Dallas County Commissioner John Wiley Price says it appears the two were husband and wife. It's believed that the husband may have come through an employee entrance, probably following someone in. The building is extremely secure. Some of us who have all access can't get past uh, the, you know, the building. Both Price and Dallas County Judge Clay Jenkins now offering their condolences to the victim's family. Jenkins says the autopsies will be done in Collin County. You know, our, our thoughts and prayers are with our Dallas County family. It's a, it's a big family, at times a messy family, but a family nonetheless, and we're all grieving the loss of one of our own tonight. And we were told that there were witnesses to all of this. They're being interviewed tonight. It's expected to be a long night. Reporting live in Dallas, Aaron Jones, CBS 11 News.